My name is Nicole Stringer. I am from Kelowna, BC. I have cystic fibrosis. And I'm her husband, Ben. Uh, we're in New York to see Hamilton, courtesy of Front Row Foundation. What's it like living with SCF? Um, you know, I actually get asked that question a lot, and I feel like because you're born with cystic fibrosis, it's the only life I know. This is my normal, like waking up every day, taking 100 pills a day, and doing lung therapies, and you know, all that's just my normal. Growing up, I feel like I grew up like a pretty normal kid. I was in a lot of sports. I was in track. I was in softball, volleyball. Uh, I wasn't hospitalized until I was nine years old. Um, and that's rare. I feel like a lot of kids um, are hospitalized as infants until grade 11. Um, I got really sick. I ended up growing this very bad super bug called atypical mycobacterium avian complex. <laughs> Short form MAC. <laughs> I actually had to uh, stop going to school. I homeschooled myself from grade 11 and 12. Um, which was kind of hard because I'm a twin, so my sister kept going to school and got to keep living the life that we were living up until I had to get pulled out. So I'm 27 now and um, I feel like in the last two years things have changed quite a bit and I'm in the hospital a lot. Um, my lung function is very low. I'm at the last stage for a lot of antibiotics. Um, my right lung is not healthy. And so I, a lot of things are gonna start getting worse before they get better, but it's okay. I have Ben <laughs> and he makes everything okay. So. Yeah. Um... I mean, as a spouse of somebody with cystic fibrosis, there's a lot of challenges and, and supports that you have to be ready to face. And I mean, I think I'm really lucky. Nicole is, you know, she's Nicole. It's not like I knew her and then everything suddenly changed. She has cystic fibrosis. I've seen things adjust and evolve as we've been together, but she's always been this really strong person who can go out and advocate for herself and take care of things. And, an alternate version of the world. I think she would be some sort of a super doctor slash patient advocate, but um, at the same time, it, it's just the more we're together and the longer we've been married and in relationship, I've learned to read her and know that on the outside, when she's projecting, rah, 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 I've got this, and, and you know, I know what's best, that she just needs that extra somebody to help support because there isn't a break from cystic fibrosis. It's all the time. I, I, it's just, New York has just always been that dream of mine. And I think, you know, probably that's a lot of people would say that, but I, it just always had like the special place in my heart. Um, it was like, we were, when we were walking down the street yesterday and, and the Hamilton signs were, up in lights and I looked up and I was like, oh God, like, <laughs> it's here, like, it's, it's, I'm here, like, oh, like, it didn't, I never in a, what, in a million, million years ever think that this would happen. Nicole's just trying to get her, her oh, stomach, so, all right. Let's go! Your room, guys.
I would definitely say, I mean, my favorite countries are, um, We just finished watching Hamilton, and uh, it what, what you, yeah, it was really amazing. The whole oh, thing crap. was great. Oh, um, I'm kind of taken at a loss for words because from the second it started to the very end, it was just go go go, like high octane. Um, it was funny. It was, it was moving. more than I expected. Mm -hmm. Like I came in with an expectation. It was just like it went up above the gates. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, Front Row Foundation. Foundation. It was amazing. It was ev like beyond expectations. Like you go in thinking you know how it's gonna be from like seeing clips on YouTube or seeing pictures, and you go in and you see the stage and it's familiar, and then it starts and you're like, <gasps> <laughs> and then we're so close. I got some actor spit on me. <laughs> So you know you're in the good seats. Yeah, that's how you know you're in like the the money maker seats. Like <laughs> we were that close. Like I made some eye contact. I'm pretty sure I have some best friends for life. We just want to say a huge thank you to the Front Row Foundation mm -hmm. for making my like ultimate dream, like never in a million years wish come true, to the Row New York City. Oh, the room here is amazing. The staff, mm -hmm. like we were greeted, like as we walked up the stairs with like the two most like lovely ladies that like made me my own like little name tag and they like handed me gifts and we walked into the room and there's balloons everywhere. Yeah. And they had like my own personal snacks already like in the fridge, which was <laughs> like those little things are like what means most to me. City mm -hmm. for being loud and fun and you know, not what's at home. <laughs> we do not have this at home. Anytime I would think of this exact, like every every aspect of whatever happened here, it was always in fantasy land. And you know, if we ever win the lottery land, or <laughs> it seemed like you know the thing that I wanted the most, but always seemed so far out of reach. And I honestly thought my wish was too big. I thought if I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, it was the top thing that had been floating around in my brain for years, and they did it. They made it come true. So just like every, every part of this, like seriously, front row, you are my dream contours, <laughs> dream makers, making up words now. <laughs> That's what you are. So. Thank you so much. Hey. Yeah. Front row, go front row. The foundation. Front row rap, baby. Tell them when you're at. Been a long time since we all been on the map. I got my whole fan with me. We ready to grind. From the Yankees came to medieval times. I gotta live life line by line. You're destined to be great. Now it's your time to shine. Anything you need to know, you can learn. Next up to bat, that's you. It's your turn. See, life ain't fair.